Okay. So, the backs- sorry, Julian, the backstory is Shane jumped on. I, I don't know whether it was your life the other day or Shufflin's life. Might have been Shufflin's. And on. Yeah, maybe was. Yes, Julian, what's popping? Are you good? Yeah, Hello, man. Hello, Anton. Good. Hello, Louise. Are you all right? I'm good, love. Are you okay? Yeah, not bad. Anton, good. have you seen yeah. that, um, that film fraud um, channel? Yeah, yeah, I've subscribed to it today. Yeah, so did I. Did you see that video we done earlier? Which one? Just the like the last one, the latest one. He speaks in it. No, I didn't see that. No, I don't think I have. Why? Enlighten me. Right, right, you're you're no more than me. But I think I don't know. I remember Polo, that sort of voice. I think it might be that Polo dude. I don't know, but he he, he says what he used to say. So you know, like well, 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 the voice of the common man or whatever it is. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. So, yeah. Quick, oh, go oh, on. Oh, you know more oh, than me. I, 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 oh. Let me just have a look. See if I can oh, get no, it big, big, no, it's all right. Big fee saying he's um no, that's uh, from an old video of Apollo Apollo Julian. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well, that's clarified. Oh. Ah. Oh, yeah, um, I think they tagged me in a bit of a video then today. So, yeah, I, that's why I ended up subscribing to it today, that um, fill and fraud thing. Yeah, he's putting it, well, the thing is, he, he's putting it all together so it's out of his own mat, out of fucking film boy's mouth, isn't it? I mean, yeah. I mean do you know what? Mind. And it's easier, it's easier to pick up when someone does it like that. Yes, yes. That- I do like things like that, what fame film for all you're doing but he's a shit house but see how you're bigging him up because he's slagging somebody off you're not getting on with but when i do it against other people or, or other subjects i'm a troll i'm a shit bag i'm a cunt you just want to do your research to people who are coming on your panel like cpa we put something up about here but you don't. She's big, been bigged up on loads of panels. And look what she's doing. Wednesday, the 6th of November, 2019. What follows is an exposure of Child Protection Awareness, CPA, who claim to be the biggest online hunting operation in Ireland, currently numbering 165,000 followers on their main Facebook page, among others run by the same people with other names. This is a public information video on the organisation and the people who run it. All- As you say, it's public, public video. All of what's being discussed will be summarised in the description below this video. Following this brief synopsis, more links shall be presented on the screen. The leader of this organisation goes by the pseudonym Louise A. Grace Joy. Real name, Audrey Louise Joyce. We are urging the public not to give any money to this organisation. They have a GoFundMe page and are constantly asking for money, with the threat that they cannot continue without such funding. Audrey, the recipient of the donations, has this to say about her fundraising. The account fund, just for the nosy ones, Sarah Allen. I think you owe me an apology for telling everyone I've stolen the money. Majority of people who gave has asked for it to be donated, which it will be. Thumbs up, thumbs up, sunglasses icons. I'm not a thief and no liar, but the sheep will keep going. In other words, her benefactors have all been scammed. Having investigated this group for four weeks now, We've been inundated with information from people from all over Ireland and the UK, many of whom had been followers of the group, but also from victims of the intimidation, libel, defamation and harassment, which appears to be the modus operandi of the leaders of the CPA, more specifically, Audrey Joyce. Due to the evidence put before us, which we seek to share with you all through this sequence of videos and supporting evidence, we confidently assert that Audrey Joyce is a compulsive liar, a megalomaniac, a bully, and that her purported aims have been seriously called into into question and have undoubtedly undermined her and the CPA time again 
and which shall be detailed. We're aware of numerous people whom have fallen victim to the false allegations of Audrey Joyce and her followers, of the trouble it's caused them, their friends and their families. Highly significantly, due to the secrecy of the group, the victims have found it impossible to seek recourse, including gaining help to seek remedy via the court. Thankfully, we can now confirm our identity, her full name, what she looks like, her address, her car registration and her place of work. Should it be the case that any such person seeks to take legal action for harassment, malicious communications, libel, defamation of character, endangerment, etc. This confirmation also enables any such affected person to serve court documents against her. We are pleased to announce that we have a team of people on standby who can advise and assist you understand your options, including any subsequent steps all of which will be wholly free of charge and we certainly do not require or seek any funding. We are also aware of the network of accomplices, some of whom have been identified. However, we must advise one and all that it is in their best interest to disassociate with this woman, especially where she relies upon their assistance to stalk, harass, spread disinformation online or elsewhere and bring the hunting concept into disrepute by using the CPA platform with its supporters as a means to attack anyone who might seem like an obstacle to her. Exemplifying the extent of her incredible negligence was one case where a young man, innocent Pat Flynn, 32, married with two young children from Waterford, was attacked in July, July of 2018. He had his windows smashed and had dye pedo scum sprayed over his car. These things cannot be unsaid or unheard. When Pat messaged the CPA's Audrey Joyce stating that she may have ruined his career and life, she responded by stating, it's not my fault that you have the same name as a predator. That's just one example of many that will be revealed in due course. We now, so constant money coming out of her account will flag up on her yes. account, on her yes, online I've got all the texts so on my phone saying, why did you do up multiple people taking what? out of her, taking out of her account. Can't you phone. take a screenshot, Trace, and show us now? Of what? She no, probably no. won't. Just like some other people have got the texts, aren't they, Trace? How can, you can tell it's up to date by what it says and what you're doing at the moment. How can anybody take you serious when stuff like this is coming out about you? About what you're doing behind the scenes. You're playing people for your own narrative. And this stuff needs to come out about you to show people what are you like. And people are bigging you up, but you don't see the real truth. This is why it needs people like me to show people what you are doing behind the scenes to other people. You you try and make yourself relevant on every platform going. Make people feel sorry for you. Make people do things for you. But you can do it yourself. We've seen that. We've seen videos of you on fight, the real fighting Irish with your daughter. You're capable of doing it yourself. I don't believe that there's anything wrong with you really deep down. You're playing the fucking game and it's wrong. These are the taxis you've been sending.